this place look familiar to you? It's not just the bullet holes from last year, there's fresh ones in this building on Darcel Avenue in Mississauga. A year ago, it's known as the Malton Shoot-Up, which was where young Jonathan Davis was killed and a whole bunch of other people were hurt, including Mervat Jamal. You came home, did you come through the front and see all the bullet holes through the front door? Uh, yeah, but I, I was with my friend, but I came like in the back of the police, but mm -hmm. they didn't let us, the police didn't let us. What, what did you think when you saw that out of the front again? Did you think, oh my God, it's the same thing as that day? Yeah. I remember everything. I remember everything that happened that day. It's like the same. Yeah. Bad remembrance. If there already wasn't enough carnage, now we've got a 17 year old boy that's been struck. Right here, right here, 10 shots, and you can see the bullet holes. They're all over the place in the garbage can, they broke the windows, and they're in the elevator. And it's just wrong, and yet it keeps on happening. Now the mayor's been here, and the police have been here, and they've made some small arrests in that case, and this one, the gunmen are on the loose again. God knows where they'll strike me. When I come here to Darcel, I don't just think of the shootings. I think of the victims, and I also think of the people that have to continue to live. No, but you were one of the people yeah. who was here. And he died, you saw him die, you were right here. Yeah. And it was only a year ago, and you're still hurting over that. We're just getting over it, not really getting over it, but we are coping. But this does bring us so much pain, like... To think that every time they hear a gunshot or even a loud noise, it brings it all back. Uh, sometimes like I have a really bad nightmare, so I like wake up in the middle of the night. And I always like get scared when I hear when I hear a loud a loud voices. So like uh, when I look at my arm or like you know I look at my window out of outside of the window. I always remember that that day and like my arm. I don't know why, but always like when I remember that day, my arm always hurt me. I don't know. Why. It's a bad remembrance. Yeah. This is wrong. This is Mississauga, this is Canada, and we've got to do something about it before more people are killed. I know nobody cares out there in the political world, but come on. The police are the good guys. These people are the good guys. The bad guys are the gunmen. With Jack Boland at another shooting scene, Joe Warmington, Toronto Sun.